Good morning on this beautiful morning. Yeah. Right before Memorial Day, we are going fishing. We don't have to go very far because we're in our community. We're only walking about eh, a tenth of a mile to our to our fishing spot. What are we catching today, Archer? Um, peacock bass. Peacock bass. And what kind of bait are we going to use? Um, we're going to use a um, bluegill and some little man cichlid. So live bait, right? Yep. No. And how are we going to catch those live bait? Um, um, with, with this green thing, it's called a cast net. We're going to throw a cast net. Archer's pulling our little wagon. We have a lake right behind our house, but to catch yeah. the peacocks, we got to go to a certain spot in a different lake. Yeah, it's like right there. It's right like over here. here you can't see it's behind those houses. But we call it Peacock Pond, right? Yeah, and like, and sometimes, sometimes you might get lucky and you might catch a largemouth bass. A largemouth bass. Okay, all right, we'll check so in. We got to the spot we're going to use for our bait fish. We're well, actually pretty close because our house is right there. But we seem to do a better job getting bait next to this cypress preserve. Hey, guys, and, and look, that's really good because there's a big pipe right there. So Archer sees a big pipe in the water. We yeah, usually have some success. And that means your skirt could be like a lot of fish hanging out over there. See a lot of grass in the fish liner. Yeah. Fish like to hang out in. Oh, I see some. Oh, I see some fish right there swimming. He's already seeing some. It's kind of probably hard to see from the yeah, camera. Yeah, but they're up. But I could. Let's see what Archer. Archer threw it out there. We'll see what he got there. Yeah. It looks like he has a big, not really a big fish, but a big bait fish. Pull oh. it out and see what you got, Archer. Oh. Oh, yo, we got a big one. We got I'll put it out. We'll grab it. Did you get it? Oh, there it is on the ground. Pick it up. Look. Oh, you got no, two. We can't use this one, guys, because this one's too big. So we have to throw this one back. But that one's a perfect size. That one's a, it's a very good size. So put them in our little bucket one. with the other ones right there. Yes, we need, we need this tree. There's Tegan across the canal, across the lake at our house. She saw us and she's cheered us on. After pulling in another throw, let's see what he pulled in. Is that a big guy in there? Let's see what that big guy's all about. What is it, Archer? It's a bluegill. Bluegill? Let's pick it up it's and see. It's not a sunfish. It's a bluegill? Let's see. But I like to like fishes like on them. Like. Brother mouth. There you go. All right. Well, good work. Go put them in our bucket over there. Yeah, my 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 pinky hurts because like one of the fishes spiked you. One of the fish spiked you with on, the, on your pinky finger. Yeah, on my little. That's not good. And you tell our lake is down from what it usually is. Usually it's up to the grass line, but it had rained a while. I put the lid on there, the fish will jump out. We got about um, 24 fish. Let's get a bubble and keep it alive. Make some mighty good bait fish, won't they, Archer? Yep. Let's do it. All right. So here's where we do our bait fishing right here in this lake. But across from that house right there, across the streets, where our, our actual peacock pond is. So we're going there now. So we made it to Peacock Pond. It's usually a lot deeper. Like you can see the. Uh, the water line usually goes up to the grass, but we almost always catch peacocks when we come here. Sometimes we'll catch some Mayan cichlid or a largemouth bass or two, but always, oh, the ducks are attacking something. Always at least, uh, except some peacock bass. I'm just getting ready. So we both have two different extremes in our poles. Actually, all I have is my ocean rod, which is a heavy duty rod, which is way too much for this. I have an 80 pound braided line, but it'll work, but not needed. Archer on their hand has a cheaper fishing pole, yeah. but has a leader on there about 20 pounds. So let's see what he can get out of this. We don't use any sinkers or any boppers. We love live bait. Archer, your bait's gonna die if you don't throw it out there. Hurry up. There's a couple peacocks you can see in the water right there. See if we can entice them to bite or not. Folks, Archer just hooked the first fish of the day. Bite it, buddy. Reel it in. Keep reeling it, buddy. Put it on the ground, put it on the ground. Looks like a Mayan cichlid. Um. Looks like he's also caught on my line, it looks like. But let's see what you got there. 
Oh yeah, I definitely got caught on my line right there. See that? Yep. Looking good, Archer. Looking good, buddy. He literally threw it in, and 30 seconds later, or not even 30 seconds, he got another fish. Oh, I just broke his line. Did you hear that snap? You can see the peacock there. His little pole. It's like we're going to use daddy's pole to get some peacocks. No. Disappointment. Change of plans. I had to give Archer my fishing pole, which is a heavy-duty guy. It's like it's an 80-pound test, so this one won't snap this, but that's kind of a big pole for him to manage. They're already swimming around there. Let's see how quick this goes. It's a beautiful day outside today. It's early, not quite summer, but and the heat really hasn't quite suck in. Oh, threw the fish off. We can see the fish swimming around as bait. I don't know if they're playing or what they're doing, but they're not sure as heck not eating. Archer left me, so I don't have anyone to record this, but I just caught another cichlid right here. I need to go get some a drink from the water. Still no peacocks, but they are everywhere. Here's that bite. Good coloring on this fish right here. So Archer left, and we finally caught, he had to get some drink, but I finally caught a peacock. Look at this beauty right here. It is a beaut. Here's my foot, my sandal for comparison. It's about 12 inches long. So this is about 13 inch fish right here. This big guy right here, this beautiful peacock. I wish we were going to throw it back. There we go. Beautiful guy right there. Oh, there's a bunch of them right there. There's another one right there. There's a carp back there, too. All in all, a good, a good day to go fishing. So we will see you next time.